greater you feel when you achieve it. A lovely morning to each and everyone. I am Nat Titus. On behalf of Class 8, warmly welcome our respected principal, Sister Rentina, sisters, teachers, and my dear friends to this morning's assembly. As you all know that no program can be started without remembering the Almighty, the creator of the whole universe. I would like to call on Angela for the prayer song. Everything I am, everything I am, everything I be, everything I be, I give it to you, Lord, I give it to you, Lord, and do it thankfully, thankfully, every song I sing, every prayer. I bring everything I do is a gift to you. Everything I have, everything I have, all you given me, all you given me, I give it to you, Lord. I give it to you, Lord, and do. Thankfully, every song I sing, every praise I bring, everything I do is a gift to you. Prayer is our connection to God. It comes from our heart. Prayer is the beginning of establishing a proper relationship with God. Consistent prayer releases the power of God's blessings on our life and circumstances. God says, prayer is one of the ways in which a man cooperates with God. It involves a complete surrender of our entire self to God. Oh God, our Heavenly Father, as we start another day, please guide us and protect us and be our companion on our life journey. Help us to do our best for Thee now and every day. God, we thank Thee for the night and for the pleasant morning light, for the rest and food and loving care, and all that make the world so fair. Help us to do the things we should and be kind and good in all we do and all we say to grow more loving every day. God, keep our families relatives and friends away from silent killer of coronavirus keep us under your divine protection amen thoughts for the day always try to represent yourself happy initially it becomes your look gradually it becomes your habit and finally it becomes your personality swami vivekananda students are the repository of all that is vital and vigorous in the society they are the vital forces in the social organisms. It is essential that students should realize this and make good preparations for playing their role in the society and answering the call of time to come. Thoughts on the rights and duties of a student are as follows. Find joy in everything you choose to do. Every job, relationship, home. It is your responsibility to love it or change it. It is important for students to understand and be aware of their privacy rights and the limits of their rights. Do not deadly. It is only when you take the responsibility for your life that you discover how powerful you truly are. Alana Hund. Every child has the right education as much as to life and every woman the right to live with money. We have a social responsibility, a constitution opportunity and a moral obligation to help others. Danny Lewis Your child has the right to receive equal treatment as you have the right that they should honor you above the world. You must take the responsibility. You cannot change the circumstances, the seasons or the winds, but you can change yourself. Jim Brown The moment you take responsibility for everything in your life is the moment you can change anything in your life. Hall and Road if you take responsibility to yourself, you will develop a hunger to accomplish your dreams. Let's promise. A pleasant morning to one and all. Respect the sister and Jenna, our principal, sisters, teachers and my dear friends. Today, I want to say a few words about the topic, the duties and rights of a student. 
A student is primarily a person who is enrolled in school and other educational institution and who is underlearning for goals for acquiring knowledge, developing professions and achieving employment at all desired fields. First, he must study well. He should be sincere to himself as a student. He must have devotions to work. A student is also a future citizen. He should know what is happening in the country and around the world. He should develop both his mind and his body. He should participate in debates and discussions. He should be loyal and helpful to his friends and classmates. But study comes first. Rights and responsibilities of a student are as follows. Students rights. Students have the right to learn and to be free to express their opinion, feelings and ideas. Students have the right to be happy and to be treated with understanding and respect. Students have the right to hear and be heard and the right to quiet times for learning and studying. Students have the right to be safe and secure in school. Students have a complete right to learning new things and also develop their own learning style that is different from others. It is the right of every student to get proper guidance during school. They can get the best advice from their teachers. Students should be informed about their academic as well as extracurricular progress by their teachers on a regular basis. Students should be given equal rights to participate in activities at school, be it sports, academic or extracurricular. Duties of a student He has some duties towards the society also. He must be prepared to undertake the social responsibilities. But the main duty of a student is to study well. He needs to do something for the nation, but it should not be at the cost of his studies. A student must learn good manners. A student must be polite, obedient and courageous. Students must follow the rules and regulations of the institution right from the prayer meeting in morning to leaving the school. Students should not only keep their academic record good but also should be implementing their learning. Students must know the value of the school property and shouldn't damage the properties. A student should not use the facilities like computers, sport items or access to restricted areas without permission. Student should know their behavior and moral responsibilities towards the school and classmates. An ideal student's trait makes him unique among others. It is believed that an ideal student will not waste his time and energy on not productive things. They will be always goal oriented. They will respect everyone and will obey their instructions and orders. Thank you. Have a nice day. Angana Taima will nin Nadiate Param Vige Amaden Netra Tilnin Nodino Chudu Kane. Naluma Satin Mumbi Lerinal Kodi Chitti Balama Gandam Puvi Tunigal Vidi Yave Amadan Mani Kutan Putiri Kati Chapol Amalar Chendon Nodi Chalahadi Chedutti Chodichu Madava Pol Unnigal vidinyapu, vodichu kalanile, kusrudi kurium neni, mangani virum nerem, odichen nedu kendon, pungula talun nadu, talukol lani tale, paidalin bavam mari, vadanam bujam vadi, Kaidavam kana kano, kano nir tadagamai. Mambaram perukuan, nyan varyun nilen naven. Manpedum malar kula, yerinu verum manil. 
വാക്കുകൾ കൂട്ടി ചൊല്ലാൻ വയ്യാത്ത കിടങ്ങളെ ദീർഘദർശനം ചെയ്യും ദൈവഞ്ഞാരല്ലോ നിങ്ങൾ प्रारंभ से ही बच्चों को ईश्वर का रूप माना जाता है लेकिन आज की तस्वीर इससे बिल्कुल अलग है है कीमती बच्चे फिर भी क्यों नंगे पैर ये सड़कों पर भीख मांगते हैं अपनी किस्मत की रेखा छोटे बर्तनों में घिसते हैं घर बाजार वासना के हाथों रोज बिकते हैं हम रोज ये सुनते पढ़ते और देखते और सो जाते हैं चलो देर से ही सही अब जाग जाते हैं और इन बच्चों को इनका हक दिलाते हैं assignments you have only one more question to do okay who do you want to be when you grow up your mother or father well that's easy you probably want to grow up to be just like mummy right mummy actually no i want to be like dad you don't want to be like me no because your work is not hard at all and daddy's work is more important All done. Now I can go and play. Mom, mom, mommy, I'm hungry. Can you make me some food? Oh no, honey. I am not feeling up to it. But it's not that hard. Okay. Mommy, I made mess. Can you help me to clean it up? Oh, I'm sorry baby. I'm just not in the mood to clean it right now. But okay. it's not hard. Okay. Mommy, I dirtied my favorite shirt. Can you please wash it? Oh no, honey. I'm just not feeling like washing at too nice. But it's not hard. Okay. You don't want to be like mommy? No, because your work is not hard at all. Mommy, can you please check my homework again? I want to be like mommy because 
Her work is super important. I'm sorry, mummy. It's okay. Come here. We usually think the workers having to go into an office, but the truth is just as much work happens back at home. It's just not as appreciated, but little steps can make a big difference. And acknowledging someone's hard work makes them want to work even harder. Even taking a second to appreciate someone can make the entire day happy. So my challenge to you is the next time someone does something nice, whatever that giving us something a hot meal or taking care of a spill, try showering them with your appreciation and watch their smile. Spread from cheek to cheek. They are just going to be over like a mole, and more likely to send the appreciation right back to you. So, more appreciation you give, the more appreciation you will get back. Thank you. Good morning, dear sisters, teachers, parents, and my loving students. I wish all of you a happy day, and congratulate Mrs. Shija. and the students of class 8 for organizing this morning's assembly for us focusing on the theme rights and duties of a student student life is the happiest period in the life of a person it's a phase when an individual acquires the values of hard work discipline punctuality teamwork unity and more and strive to become a successful and good human being it's a period of time that shapes an individual and prepares him or her to face the upcoming challenges of life with courage and strength mahatma gandhi remarked that a duty well performed creates a corresponding right with rights come duties and responsibilities in the life of every individual and each one of us is expected to perform and discharge our duties and responsibilities efficiently and help in the development of our society being in your best of behaviors be it at home in the school or in the society meeting the academic expectations being respectful and obeying the parents and teachers maintaining discipline in the class keeping the school and home neat and tidy greeting everyone with a smile and respect being helpful abiding by the rules of the school completing the assigned task on time participating in the activities organized in the school cooperating with the teachers are some of the duties and responsibilities of a student ultimately All students are expected to groom yourselves as able leaders and contribute towards the development of the society where you are living in. As being part of responsible students, I would like all of you dear children to set a timetable for your studies on a regular basis and submit the same to your class teachers and your parents. Try following your timetable on a regular basis. Wishing everyone an enriching day and a fruitful week ahead. Thank you and God bless you. National anthem represents the tradition, history, and beliefs of a nation and its people. It helps evoke feelings of patriotism among the country's citizens and their nation's glory, beauty, and rich heritage. जन गण मना दिनायक जय है भारत भाग्य विधाता पंजाब सिंधु गुजरात मराठा द्राविड उत्कल बंगा विंध्य हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्चल जलदि दरंगा तव शुभ नामे जागे तव शुभ आशीष मांगे गाए तब जय गादा जन गण मंगल गायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे